I'm sorry, but Rockstar, you deserve this. Deserved. Deserved. Did Rockstar really believe they could go through 20, 30 years when this still releases in 2017? Do you think that you could really go through all this time and there would be no leaks? This is the most anticipated game ever. One of the most anti- this has to, this is one of the most, no, I believe this might be the most anticipated video game ever, which is GTA 6 based on the success of GTA 5. You think that a leak would not, would not happen? It was bound to happen. It was bound to freaking happen. And my thing is, I am happy to happen because it's called Karma. Because I was looking at what guys, guys were saying, oh my gosh, this is so bad. You know, you should, should be able to have time to, to, to really spend your things because we were all thinking that. Are these clowns even working on this whole damn thing? And I think if you look at some of the leaks, I think it said that the that the reveal was going to happen like I think called um Q no Q three Q three of this year, so pretty much around now. And basically, it's completely messed up. It's messed up everything. And I I just because I believe in karma. I believe this is just karma because you have been spending such a long time relying so much on um. Freaking GT Online and all those shark cards are not ones have been okay. Let's just have the next skin that you even messed up. And like, it would have been such a great reveal if they were able to say, Okay, we're working it. It's Bonnie and Clyde, white dude, Latina chick. Boom, here we go. Bonnie and Clyde kind of thing. Okay, boom, let's let's ride. Or going back to Vice City, it could have been a great reveal and announcement. But now that's messed up because you spend so, so freaking long. You could have announced this like last year. And say, work is been happening on GTA because this is this has this has to be like months. This has to be at least like months in which they have been working on on this stuff. So I think that um, I'm sorry, bro. Like it's karma. It's karma because I'm glad because I really believe that you know, this guy since working on GTA Six, they're making so much money on GTA Five. Now, these guys don't give a damn about working on freaking GTA 6 because there's 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 no money there. So um now does this mess up their I don't know because I don't know why this should mess up their plan because my thing though is it just messes up the release. Because what they wanted is just to release concepts out. This is what it's about, but obviously no footage. Because when you look at the footage, it's like, oh, this is definitely much in development. And some clowns said, oh my gosh, this doesn't look like much better than, than GTA 5. It's in freaking development. And I think they I think they are anticipating that this is going to be released in, I think, in 2024, 2025. So this is like one or two years from being released. So like, come on, bro. Um, but... um. Like, look, look, basically, from what I saw, it's interesting, but uh, you've got to come up with something a bit more dynamic than just, if that's your thing, or body and glide and that, and that's the time I come on, bro. Because, I mean, like, you have, I've always thought that be a cop. I think me and my brothers, we actually discussed, like, you should be a corrupt cop. A corrupt, like, detective. So you're, all right, basically, I don't know whether you heard of this game. There's this game called Open Chaos, where you could pretty much arrest people and stuff. I think, and you were like a chick and like an, an older guy. Open Chaos, cool game. Because yeah, you've never really played like a cop or play like a corrupt cop. And maybe you can choose between either you want to be corrupt or good. And maybe what I don't think GTA have ever done is multiple endings. So you could actually, so you can choose which way you want to go and how you want to operate as a cop. But let's see what they they. Do. Let's just see what they do. But for me, I just feel that the whole thing with the leaks is that, in my view, maybe you may feel it's wrong. This is karma for these clowns releasing one game on three different platforms, re releasing it, and just gossiping up money. GTA 6 should have been released by like, like years ago. GTA 6 should have, GTA 6 should have been the PS4 game. 
Like, think about it. GTA 6 should have... No, two, two, two things. Either GTA 6 should have either been the, the PS4 game, or it should have launched PS5. It should have launched PS5. So, yeah, man. Um, I'm sorry, but Rockstar, you deserved this. 